this is an operational project. Uh, we already have uh, close to around 480 companies there uh, from nine different countries. Uh, a lot of European companies are there, uh, you know, especially from continental Europe. Uh, in fact, six uh, countries from Europe are represented over there. Since we are at the EU-India conclave, so I think it's important for me to let you know about it. Uh, around 29 companies are operational as we speak, uh, and then we have more than 130 companies which are under construction. So it's a very, very active site. Uh, it's a, it's a very well developed site out of total area of around 8,000 acres which we have over there. Uh, close to around 2,000 acres is fully operational and uh, fully developed. So it's, so it's a very, very active site and a very vibrant site. Right, so you mentioned about several companies from Europe, from Asia that are going to be part of uh, this, uh, you know, Met City. You've also mentioned that there are companies that are coming in from nine countries with uh, an investment of 1,200 crores is something that was the last public information. But want to understand what is the kind of additional investment that you're seeing and the kind of job creation that this Met City is going to lead to? So, uh, out of the companies which are fully operational right now, we already have more than 40,000 direct uh, employment which has been generated over there by different companies and we expect that uh, the overall potential of the industrial park has just started to take shape now. So, putting a number right now is going to be a little uh, tough call to do. Uh, however, uh, you know, what we have looked at is that uh, companies come there, uh, they have operational excellence, uh, excellence over there, they find their efficiencies, you know, coming and manu setting up their operations over there. And this is also, uh, while we are at the EU conclave, but I think it's important for me to let you know that it is also a Japan industrial township. So we, are, we have a lot of Japanese companies which are coming it over there, apart from the European companies.